Biggest question is, how does it feel to be back on the home ice, get in front of some, some home, hometown uh, fans and play in front of the, the crowd? Almost seems like it was since, since last year. <laughs> no, it's a, it's been a long time. I mean, it seems like the, since the season has started, it's been go, 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 uh, tough travel for us. And I think it's really, uh, it's took its toll on our bodies a little bit. We were really banged up and uh, it was nice to have a break last weekend and, and find a way to get our, our bodies healed up, get some more, some more of our players back on the ice in practice. What's been, what's been the emphasis um, the past two weeks? Last week was get healed up. Uh, take a lot of time off. Uh, we, we had two days with coaches on the ice. One day where the, the players did a little round robin tournament and, uh, and days off. Uh, even in the weight room, we had uh, one day where we were in the weight room, the rest of the days were off. Uh, with having six guys injured and, and banged up, we didn't have that many bodies on the ice anyway, and we needed to get healed up. As a, uh, hockey coaches love answering this question, but what is your injury report at this point? Uh... Uh, we're good right now. Okay. Uh, we've got a couple guys that are still out with McLean and, and Odo. Uh, but the other guys are back, and it looks like they're fairly healthy, and we're getting closer. So it feels good. It feels good to get guys back on the ice. So Gettig and Crow, they're they're both 100%. We're uh, we're not sure yet. We're, I mean, Gettig will play. Uh, Crow, we're still trying to evaluate, but uh, you know, he's, he looks pretty good right now. He looked good last two days on the ice, and and we'll see. It's a little bit up to him. To see where he's at. Coming into this weekend, uh, you've got the ice out right now. It's got to be nice to kind of get some practice time in on the, the surface going into the home opener. What's really nice is obviously being in this building you get and, and for the goaltenders to get used to the, the lights, the background, uh, but also just to make use of the practice time here for us. And, and when we scrape, we can go in and, and show a little video, do a little coaching, um, and that certainly helps. When we're at the ice rink, we can't do that. and Our, our time slips away, and uh, this week was really nice to be able to do that. Coach, you guys were actually better on the road last year than you were at home. Is that something, uh, you know, consistency at home, is that something you're focusing on improving this year? Well, uh, it's a combination. Um, when we were at Wisconsin, we had the same issues. Uh, it, situation where you don't skate in the building. This week helped being in the building all week. Uh, but moving forward, we don't skate here. Uh, we skate at the ice rink and then come back over here on a Friday for the game. So uh, it's a little adjustment period for us. And it, at times, it didn't feel like home much because of that. And we've got to get our mindset away from that and, and knowing that this is our home, uh, find a way to create that environment here that's exciting and, and for our fans, for the way we play. Uh, so certainly building on that right now with our group. Back um, back a couple weeks ago, Bowling Green, you guys uh, pulled off two results considering you lost two of your uh, experienced defenders back there. How big was that to have some of your young guys step up uh, for you? Well, for us to, to come away with a uh, nationally a tie, obviously a shootout loss, but a tie and a win uh, with four of our top five defensemen out, that, that was really big for us. The way the guys competed, the other guys stepped up. I think the way the team played in front of uh, both of our goaltenders uh, says a lot about what we have in the locker room. Does the practice time really help when you get to come out here? I think you've been out here the whole week, haven't you? Oh, yeah. We've been yeah. out here the whole week. Um, the ice has been a little, you know, they've, it's been covered for a while, so it's been a little... You know, it's been all right, but um, the, you know, the more we practice, the more we get used to it. So, uh, kind of gets better as we go. It's maybe the hardest thing about playing in this building. Is it um, the, the, the lights, the the boards, anything. There really isn't. It's not really hard to play in, to be honest. You know, it's it's actually one of my favorite rinks I've ever got to play in. You know, it's it's huge. I mean, I guess that'd kind of be one of the downfalls is you know, um, it's it's as it being so big, it's not as loud as as we'd like it to be. But um, other than that, it's you know, it's a great building to play in. I love it. Real fast start for you, Matt. This year, already hit. You already have three goals. Uh, you had three all last year. What's been the difference uh, just in the early going here? Uh, I I really don't think it's been any different. Um, you know, I've had some. I the line I'm on right now is it's great. You know, I think we have great chemo. We move the puck really well, and I just you know I just been kind of getting a little lucky, I guess. Been shooting my eyes closed. Gotta yeah. do it more often. Uh, three goals on six shots. Uh, any chance you maintain that shooting percentage for the rest <laughs> of the year? Uh, I highly doubt it. <laughs> I wish. Yeah. But uh, no, I. You know, we just got to keep doing what we're doing. Um, all our lines have been playing really well. So it's, I think if we just keep the chemo that we have going, I think we'll, be, we'll do fine. Did you learn something about your squad up at BG with all, all the injuries? A lot of guys had to step up in that series. Um, a little bit. I mean, we have a young group as it is. So, I mean, it took, you know, a lot of guys to mature. I think we all had to grow up a little bit and we had to grow up faster. But, you know, I, th I, think, we, I think we responded well to it. I mean, it was, a, you know, it was a big task at hand and I think we did well with it. 
Obviously, uh, the power play has not been putting goals on the board since that first game. I think you scored your first chance of the year to score since then. Has that been a focus this week, just trying to get that going? Oh, yeah, we've been working power play, you know, hour before practice, hour after, every every day this week. So, you know, coach has just been stretching, shooting the puck, getting pucks on net, and, you know, I think we'll turn it around this weekend. You, you talked a lot about the skill and the speed this offense has, but it just feels like you're, you're, you're getting there, but it hasn't kind of exploded yet. Do you think there's a point where you guys are really going to start clicking as, a, as an offensive Oh, yeah, player? I think our lines have, you know, coaches put some good lines together, and we're really clicking, and I think... Friday night will be start of something good. How do you feel that, um, that the freshman six games in? Do you think they're they're adapted now to the college game? There's still things that they're they're learning along the way. Oh yeah, uh, you know they're young, but I coach said they had six games in, and you know they're part of the team now. We don't look at them as freshmen. You know they're we were we were we were like that. You know just a year ago, it just you know it's going to be good for them to play in our our home barn. And yeah. what did you learn about the squad up at BG? Uh, BG was the Friday night was a tight game and you know we found a way to get it done with the one and zero win and then uh, you know Saturday night was you know not the result that we wanted but you know we worked hard and I think we're going to carry that over to this weekend. But did it say something that you guys really had stepped up with so many injuries, especially defensively, that guys were able to still fill their roles on the team? Oh yeah, I think you know in every season you're going to have injuries and you're going to have st stuff you have to battle through and even uh, you know Dally coming through playing with that wrist was. You know, it showed a lot of heart, and uh, I'm excited. 